Hello, this is a quick tutorial on how to set up your Flight Sim Stuff controller in Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. From the main menu, you want to click on Options and click on Control Options. Make sure you select Flight Sim Stuff controller and search by name, type in Throttle. If you're looking for Throttle Access, click in this box, click Start Scanning and pull the throttle knob on your controller. Click Validate. And it may pop up, ask you to create a profile name, call it whatever you want. And we want to search for prop. We're looking for propeller axis, click in the box, start scanning, pull the propeller knob, validate. And then we're going to look for mixture. And you're looking for mixture axis negative 100, 200%. Start scanning, pull the mixture knob, and validate. And now we're going for trim. And you're looking for elevator trim axis negative 100 to 100% right here. Click in the box. Now you click start scanning and you turn your trim wheel a bunch and usually it will scan or uh, find it like it did this but right now. <clears throat> but if it doesn't find it for you, you can click this down arrow and you would select uh, joystick slider X. Um, just manually select it then hit validate. And you're all set there. And we would look for flaps. Uh, oh, that's... Oops, okay. Increase flaps, click in the box, push the flaps lever lever down. Oh, I'm sorry, start scanning and then click down. Validate. And decrease flaps, scroll down, find it here, start scanning, push the flaps lever up. Validate. And that will find all the controls you need. Now, if you're in a plane and you find your throttle uh, prop or mixture are backwards or trim wheel um, let's say you're trying to give it throttle and it's actually giving less throttle you come back to your controls options click on your controller go to power management throttle and then there's a reverse axis for each control so you can reverse it same with your trim um, you can set it however you like and that should do it contact me on my website if you have any questions flightsimstuff.com thanks